day two on the Rainbow River. All right, we're on the little spur trail off Rainbow River. guys thank you for coming back for part two of my trip to rainbow springs campground this time we're going canoeing last time let me show you on the map where we went we floated downstream over four and a half hours till we got to this major road intersection and got picked up in the truck and drove us back to the campground so now we're going to get in our canoes and kayaks and go upstream to the spring the spring is not at the campground you have to paddle upstream to get to it so that's what we're doing today day two on the rainbow river getting ready to take the kayaks out instead of the tubes now doing the kayak thing same place to launch All right, we're on the little spur trail off Rainbow River. It's the beautiful, so kind of semi-secluded off the main roadway path. Sweet. But we pulled off to the side to take a group photograph. Great place to do it.
taking a break on the side of the Rainbow River as we're paddling toward the Springhead. Coming up on the deepest part of the Rainbow River, here you see a dive flag anchored to the bottom. Somebody scuba diving or snorkeling. Very cool place. I did this before in a previous video. All these holes you see underneath the Rainbow River are spring heads. They're small springs pumping fresh water into the river. They're all over the place. All right, we've made it to the spring head. There's a little dock that you can pull off and park your kayak. And that's what we're doing here. We're gonna walk up to the spring head. We're gonna put on our wetsuits and get our snorkel and mask and fins and go swim at the spring head. again checking out the spring head there's lots of little springs all over this place you can see here a hole water's coming out there's gonna be sandy spots where water you can see the sand bubbling up so check it out All right, guys, we got our fill of swimming around the spring head. So let's get back in the kayaks, get a few pictures of the spring head, and we'll head back downstream to the campground.
One side of the river has houses. And the other side is natural, no houses. And we're going with the current now because we went all the way to the spring head. And now we're going away from the spring head and the current's pushing us away. Back the way we came. A little bit of wind too, a little bit. Beautiful out here. Occasional uh, clouds now. It's getting cloudier. We're hearing some thunder in the distance. But no worries, we're all wet anyway. Oh, a hawk. You hear that? It's a hawk. Oh yeah, the beautiful clear water of Rainbow Springs. I've seen about eight springs in Florida and Rainbow Springs is about the second clearest water I've ever seen. The clearest I've seen was Silver Springs. I made a video on it, so check it out. Here we're getting near the end of our paddle. Here is a cool little trail right up against the shore with the grass growing on the water and a little trail between the grass and the shore. Kind of neat, don't you think? As I came to the end of the paddle, went back to the campsite, we're all gonna have a potluck taco night. And as I was setting up, I saw this little butterfly fluttering around. I slowed down the video right here so you could see it a little easier. But it was really hard to videotape. That's going to do it for my trip to Rainbow Springs Campground. I hope you enjoyed the video. And if you did, please give me a thumb up. And if you like this kind of content and want to see more, subscribe and hit the notification bell so you'll be notified when I upload my newest video. I do other videos on cooking in the RV, nature views, as well as Disney World and other theme parks. Thank you for watching RV Weekends, and we'll see you next time.